What's going on guys, it's your boy V from Superlined. In today's video, I'm gonna be talking about the differences between these blanks right over here. I'll be going over things like price, quality, and fit to give you guys a better idea of which blank you should go with for your clothing brand. At the end of this video, you'll be able to differentiate between these popular t-shirt blanks. Okay, so we're gonna kick things off with the Gildan G500. This is the most commoditized t-shirt in the entire world. It's essentially the McDonald's hamburger of t-shirt blanks. This is gonna be the cheapest shirt for the price and its quality control and consistency is amazing. It's 5.3 ounces, 100% cotton, and it has a rough, stiff feeling. Over time, this shirt is definitely gonna shrink, so a large is gonna turn into a medium, a medium is gonna turn into a small, and so on. Gildan does not sell this shirt direct to consumer. They do the classic distributor model where you have to get an account with a distributor like Alpha Broder in order to get this shirt at the best price possible. On Alpha Broder, you can get this shirt starting at $2.59. For the price, you really can't beat that. I also forgot to mention that this shirt actually comes in 70 colors, so you won't have a problem finding the right color for your brand. Overall, this is a great shirt for giveaways, promos, and if you want the cheapest price possible. This shirt also has tearaway labels, so it's super easy to add your own neck tag, whether you want to sew something in, screen print, or even use DTF sheets to add your own logo to the neck tag area. Now we're going to move on to the All Style 1301. This iconic shirt is loved by many, especially on the West Coast. It was used by many streetwear brands in the past, such as Diamond Supply Co., The Hundreds, and Crooks and Castles. This shirt is similar to the Gildan G500, but it's thicker and has a boxier fit. This shirt would best be described as the Burger King Whopper back in its glory days. Similar to the Whopper, this shirt had its glory days back in the 2000s, when brands like Diamond Supply Co. were using it heavily. However, there are better shirts as of lately, so the craze for these has definitely died down. This shirt is 6 ounces, 100% cotton, and is thick, rough, and scratchy. It's loved by many brands on the west coast because of its LA fit and texture. For the most part, All Style does not sell these shirts direct to consumer. They're actually owned by Gildan, so you'll have to go through a distributor like Offer Broder in order to get the best price possible. These shirts come in 36 colors and start at $3.25 on Alpha Broder. Now moving on to the next level 3600. This shirt is one level up from the Gildan G500, and because of that, it's perfect for someone who doesn't want the cheapest of the cheap. I would best describe this as like an In-N-Out burger. For a couple bucks more, you're gonna get a lot better ingredients, or in this case, a lot better quality. This shirt is 4.3 ounces, 100% ring spun cotton. You're probably wondering what is ring spun cotton versus normal cotton. Well, in simple terms, ring spun cotton shirts are gonna be a lot softer, and a lot of the times a little bit more expensive. Just like the Gildan G500, this shirt is also gonna shrink over time. The larges are gonna turn into mediums, and the mediums are gonna turn into smalls. For the most part, Next Level is also not going to sell these direct to consumer. You're going to need an account with a distributor like Alpha Broder in order to get the best price possible. This shirt comes in 38 colors and starts off at $4.39. Overall, this is a great shirt for companies and brands. Because of the ring spun cotton, you're going to get a softer, more fashion-like feel. But this shirt is still not a streetwear style shirt, if that makes sense. Now we'll talk about the Bella Canvas 3001C. This shirt is very similar to the Next Level 3600. The key difference is that the Bella Canvas is made to be unisex, so the sizing is just a little smaller than the Next Level. If the 3600 is an In-N-Out burger, the 3100C is like a Whataburger. This shirt is 4.2 ounces, 100% ring spun cotton, so you're gonna get that same super soft feeling, but the shirt is definitely thinner than like the Gildan G500. This shirt is also gonna shrink over time, just like some of the other blanks we've talked about. And for the most part, Bella Canvas will also not sell these direct to consumer. You're gonna have to go through a distributor like Alpha Broder to get the best price possible. These start at $4.39 on Alpha Broder, and they're actually gonna come in a whopping 86 different colors. So just like the 3600, this is gonna be a great blank for companies and brands. If you have more of a unisex audience, this shirt is definitely the way to go. Now we'll talk about the Solid Basics Essential Tee. So this shirt is actually private labeled from Cotton Heritage. It's very similar to the 3600 and 3100C. The main difference is that because it's owned by a smaller company, 
they're willing to sell it for cheaper and without any stipulations that come with working with a distributor. To follow the comparison, this is more like a cookout burger because there's fewer of them. It's 4.3 ounces, 100% ring spun cotton, so you're gonna get that same soft feeling. And just like the others, this shirt is also going to shrink over time. And because this is a smaller company, there's gonna be fewer color and inventory options when comparing to a company like Gildan. Overall, this is a great shirt when starting out, especially if you don't have the documentation to work with a distributor like Alpha Broder. It's also very affordable starting at $4.50 and dropping down to $3.50 if you use their wholesale portal. Now let's talk about the Comfort Colors C1717. So these shirts are garment dyed, which give them more of a washed look. This shirt is more soft and fashionable when compared to its competitors, but it's also a little bit more expensive. Across universities, it's loved among fraternities, sororities, clubs, etc. If we're gonna do the same burger analogy, the Comfort Color shirts are more of like a Shake Shack. This shirt is 6.1 ounces, 100% ring spun cotton, and garment dyed. This shirt is also going to shrink significantly less because of that garment dye process and it being pre-washed. So like many other blanks I named, Comfort Colors is actually owned by Gildan as well, and they will not sell direct to consumer. You're gonna have to go through a distributor like Alpha Broder in order to get the best price possible. On Alpha Broder, these start off at $6.25 and come in a whopping 84 different colors. Overall, this is a great shirt if you're starting a streetwear brand. You can charge more for the shirt because of its quality and streetwear look. However, the one thing that's not so great about this blank is that Comfort Colors really wants to brand this shirt, so all the labels are actually sewn in and not tearaway labels. This just makes it a little harder to remove and rebrand the shirt. Last but not least, we're gonna be talking about the Shockerwear Garment Dye Tee. Honestly, this shirt is on trend to be one of the best streetwear blanks out right now. The style, fit, and material of this blank are very on trend, and the pricing is actually pretty fair as well. If we're doing the same burger comparison, this is similar to a Five Guys burger, which is coincidentally my favorite burger. You're gonna be paying slightly more for this shirt, but it's because of the quality. It's 7.5 ounces, 100% ring spun cotton. Like the Comfort Color shirt, this is also garment dyed, but it's more suited for the streetwear market. The collar is much thicker, and it's like a revamped trendy 1301. The quality, fit, and style of this shirt is so good that you could just wear it plain. If you've been wondering what shirt I've been wearing this entire video, it's actually one of the Shockerware blanks. Unlike some of the other blanks, this shirt is not owned by Gildan, and you cannot find it on typical distributor sites like Alpha Broder. They actually do have this shirt available on Alpha Broder, but it's not stocked in their warehouses. They're just drop shipping them from Shockerware itself. Because this shirt is new, you can actually buy it from us at a wholesale pricing, or you can buy it on the Shockerware website. If you go through the Shockerware website to open up a wholesale account, it's very similar to opening a wholesale account with other distributors. You're going to have to provide the proper documentation and also you're going to have to buy the product in bundles. Shockware only sells their tees in bundles of three and bundles of six. Alternatively, you can order from us on our website where you don't have to order in bundles and you don't need any documentation. In our opinion, these are the best shirts to use if you're starting a streetwear clothing brand. And we're saying that even though we have our own blank t-shirt line. In terms of pricing, quality, and overall product, this shirt really checks all the boxes. However, the one thing that's not so great about this blank is just like Comfort Colors, they have a sewn-in inside label, which makes it more difficult to remove and rebrand. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope it was very informative and helped you gain some insight onto the differences between all these blanks. I know when starting out, it can be really intimidating and you can oftentimes waste a lot of money ordering samples from all these different blanks. If you're just getting started, we hope this video made the process a little easier. Please like, comment, subscribe if you enjoyed the video. You know we stay giving y'all free game.